of the Liverpool Plin. So on behalf of Liverpool Plin Company, I'm Bill Addy, and as Chief Executive. First of all, I'd like to introduce Chris Pitt-Paley, Rector of Liverpool, on, on whose fabulous church the Plin Company is. Thank you very much, and thank you for coming to this, and thank you to the big company and for the dot art for their support and help in doing this. As Bill said, it's the fourth sculpture we've put up there. It makes the most incredible impact, not just visually, but also on the experience of people coming in. And uh, the number of comments, uh, phone calls, complaints, absolutely fantastic. Um, and, uh, and I look forward to more of them this year. I don't think there will be complaints this year, but, uh, but if we do, Faith, it's a, it really is a badge of honour, so, so I, I hope so, because that means people are engaging with it and thinking about it and, and they're looking up. And at this point in the, the city, this is a place where, where people get off their cruise ships, which, uh, there was one yesterday, um, they get up, they walk up Chapel Street, they explore the city, and, and this is the first building they come from, it's the first open heritage building, um, and they, they see that, and they stop on the street, they look at the sign, they come in, they read the exhibition. So it's a really significant part of the gateway into Liverpool, and uh, if we can make people smile, and if we can make people think, then I think that's the job done. So thank you for coming, and thank you for your support. Thank you, Chris. Thank you all again this morning. As, as I say, with Liverpool Big Company, uh, our whole ethos is about how we improve the, the city centre. And for us, the partnerships that we have with the public arts uh, institutions in the city is a tremendous part uh, of our business plan. So it's a delight to be able to continue to support. And we look forward, now that we have a culture and commerce bid which is extended for a further five years, we look forward to continuing that relationship. But this year is all about the statue that will be on the cliff. Just um, before we look at this year's, just a word for Gail. And thank you for Tidal Shame. Tidal Shame has stood there for the whole of the year. And people have looked up and said, what's that pile of rubbish doing <laughs> on the church? And actually, that's the message it gives me, because the rubbish that was in there, we know from last year, was rubbish that's collected around the world. And sadly, it's still more prevalent, and we need, still need to do that. This, so thank you for that, Gail. And hopefully, Tidal Shame is with Chris and will be safely returned to you to be exhibited elsewhere. So thank you for all your contributions. Thank you. The faith, the work that you've uh, brought for us this year, when we undertook the, the project again of bringing um, various uh, artists together to see whose sculpture would be the one that sits on the cliff, uh, we came together, we met, obviously we looked at a large number of entries, but yours stood out, stood out for a number of reasons, and in a few moments, we're gonna release that. So we do hope that this year, more people will engage with you and with your artwork uh, as they see this sculpture. So we're very much looking forward to that. So thank you for all that you've done. Thank you for uh, this statue that's about to be unveiled. And without any more words for me, unless Lucy wants to say something to Dr. because you're the person that curated all of this. Um, <laughs> nothing like being put on the spot. Um, yeah, thank you very much for coming. Um, I guess I'd just like to say that um, we're very, very excited to have uh, the new sculpture, which is called Jimmy, uh, being unveiled today. Um, I think it's really lovely that we have our first Liverpool-based artist um, as the, the Flint, uh, this Flint sculpture, this sculpture this year. It's also um, a, a, like, like Gales. It's linked to the uh, climate emergency. It's made of recycled materials, which I think is another really important thing. And uh, as always, we, it has some kind of link to to the the location here, and in this case, to the canal system. Um, so I won't give too much away, but uh, but yeah, so thanks again to the bid for, for helping us do this and to the church for hosting it as always, and we're really excited to uh, to unveil our, our fourth Liverpool Plinth sculpture. Should we go to the edge? Let's go and see. Let's go to the edge.